hello folks in this video we are going to demonstrate the custom bootloader that we have made for stm32 f407 and we are also using esp8266 to communicate with the aws server wherein we are using the s3 bucket service and wherein we have made a bucket named as application.binary this uh, bucket will store the binaries which will be uh, downloaded in the ESP8266 and further then ESP8266 will transfer this uh, binaries to the STM so as you can see now if I press the reset button here the STM will be checking for the update and if it uh, receives an NAC from the ESP this means that uh, the ESP8266 currently does not have the updated binaries as you can see fr from here in the bucket there is no uploaded files and uh, we are also getting the forbidden error from the from the HTTPS GET request this is due to this is because we have no uploaded files in the AWS uh, bucket so now when we upload the bucket uh, when we upload the file in the bucket ESP will now detect the file and will send acknowledgement to the STM when I press the reset button again as you can see from here if the file is uploaded in the uh, ESP's uh, flash this light will glow so now if I pr again press the reset button here you can see the debug message that uh, downloading the update it has detected the update and it is now downloading the uh, uploaded files and as you can see from this uh, debug UART ESP the files are being sent in the form of stream using X modem now as you can see here we have received the end of uh, transaction end of transaction byte and you can see the STM's uh, debug UART is asking that up upload is uh, updated file is available now if I press the switch it will upload the file but if I press reset again it will again ask to the ESP side and hence uh, we have downloaded the previously downloaded the uploaded file ESP is sending a NAC to the STM and STM's debug UART is again asking that uh, update is available in its download area as you can see this is the download area sector 8 from sector 8 to sector 11 is the download area in here this uh, uploaded file file is stored so if I press reset and uh, press the user button now the uploaded uh, file is being to the user area and as you can see from here new uploaded code is running executing